What's going on? It's yours. Truly just say it with me. They call me Miss Telefair. How y'all doing out there? Look, I'm all about prospering. I'm all about trying to get as many of my people with me to the next level. And if I can't financially help you get there, hell, the best thing I could do is put the news out there that hopefully could get you to the next level. There are some black men that are doing a lot of great things in the atmosphere. They come from two totally different backgrounds, but at the, the core element of where they come from is the same, right? Like, I'm sure you've never heard of Tyler Perry and P from QC in the same sentence, but these dudes both come from nothing, and they got a whole lot of something right now. Tyler Perry just unveiled his new 330-some acre studio. And P from QC has QC off the ground. They manage artists. You might have heard of them. Uh, they got this artist. Her name is um, Cardi B. You might have heard of this rap group that they manage. Uh, they, they go by the Migos, 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 Migos. I had to do that every time I say the Migos. I got to go Migos. Me anyway, uh, Lil Baby and a, a plethora of other artists on the label over there. Layton Green. They got a lot of names. and City Girls. All that great stuff over there. And they're only growing. Uh, the reason why I brought up P from QC and Tyler Perry was for this one reason. A few months ago, there was an actor looking for a shot, and she decided to shoot her shot via a billboard in Atlanta, Georgia. She knows Tyler Perry's popping, and he's in Atlanta often. That's where he resides, in his studio and all that stuff. So uh, this actor decided to put up a billboard and try to get the attention of Tyler Perry, and it actually worked. Now, Tyler Perry did tell other actors or fellow actors, don't do it again. But Tyler Perry has acknowledged that he has given this young lady a role in some type of production that he's got going. So though Tyler Perry said, don't do it again, anyone else out there, for that young lady, it worked. She put a billboard up for Tyler Perry to see, and it worked. Now, fast forward. There's an artist. Young artist copied that young lady's formula. This time, he wasn't looking for Tyler Perry. He was looking for P from QC. There's a billboard in Atlanta, Georgia right now that's up. The artist's name is Silk So Fi. And the billboard says, tell QC to sign me. It got over to Say Cheese, a big hip-hop platform. P saw it, and he said, I see you. He told her to hit up one of his people on QC to set up a meeting so we can see what's up. So, I'll follow my fellow artists out there. Look, I don't know if it's going to happen for you. I'm just saying, maybe you, you want to throw up a billboard. Maybe that could be your way. Look, what I love about this era is with social media, there are so many ways to get in contact with all these big-time execs that back in the day, these guys just used to kind of be unreachable. But in 2019, these people are very reachable. Hell, they're actually looking for you. I've heard P a couple times say, yo, I get on social media and just look for talent. I found Layton Green because I just DM'd her, right? Like, it can happen. You, you know, the best way, obviously, is to put out a dope product, whatever you're doing, and the product will f make its way into the right hands. But maybe you got to go outsource a little bit, and it looks like this young artist might get a chance, Silk So, Silk so Fi, maybe a chance with one of the biggest rap ga labels in the game right now. He's got a meeting if he can make it happen and, and, and hit this lady up with P from QC. So maybe I just want to put that out there. Maybe it can help a young aspiring artist who's got a little money on him. They're looking to kind of put this money into maybe promo or give it to a DJ to promote their music. Maybe the best way is to keep that money and put it into a billboard. I don't know. It could work for you. What y'all think about this very dope story? Y'all let me know in the comment box below. I'm out. I came from nothing, but I want everything God has for me. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I still represent the culture. I got the kids. They Tuned in. Tuned in. We locked in right now, Mr. Telefair. Mr. Telefair. Telefair. Shout out to Mr. Telefair. You watching Mr. Telefair TV. Mr. Telefair TV.